So the art team's been putting in a bunch of new cool customizable clothes and things for the paper doll. Uh, updating some of the graphics based on the feedback. The game designers have been hard at work, uh, uh, you know, getting new content in, new stories, new missions. So it's kind of like we made the ice cream, now we're getting all the toppings on it. People are beginning to understand what we've been talking about uh, these past couple of months. <sighs> I can see the camera moving this way. Oh wait, what if, what if we came in? What if we, oh, okay, wait, wait, what if we did, uh, uh, Perfect, let's do it, film it, cut, go! So we got a new corporate video. We were doing a lot of shooting for the last week uh, using the new uh, department, the new green screen. And I think everybody did a great job, you know, in the scenes. And I think the theater scene is going to be really funny. So, yeah, I was excited. Well, the big news is coming out on Monday is we're announcing that Heat Wave has acquired Gods and Heroes. It has all the problems that an MMO that's 90% done has. It's the last 10%, that's the hardest part. Gods and heroes will rise again! One of the things about being a startup is that everyone expects you to fail, because so many of them do. And of course, I think everyone who's in a startup expects it to succeed. And it's not until you actually start putting a product out that people can go, oh, hey, look, they're doing it. It's exciting. And you know, I think every week we talk about how busy it is, but uh, you know, this is the time when we make it happen. So laying it down. You know, stay tuned. Same bad time, same bad channel.